right, guys, we've been chumming up the mangrove snapper here. Sorry for not uploading, I went to the Keys. We caught some fish, but nothing I can make a video with, and then I've been back to school. But now we're back out here fishing. My motor also has a leak in it, so it's kind of risky being out here, but have to make a YouTube video. So we're throwing in, we got a piece of green back on right here. Dropping it in the water. What I'll do is I'll just take a good amount of these, chuck them out there as freebies. Oh. Breach, that's not a big one. That was Kubera S. I just had one. Oh, hell. The free kid got torched, so we're gonna take a good chunk. Someone caught a Kubera in Tampa Bay the other day, so. Bro! <laughs> there was number two. Kubera. I think, I think we're, we're on a little rusty. We're on Kubera rocks right now. Ah, we are out of our. We tried yellowtail fishing in the Keys, could not get it done. We are getting torched right now. Our technical difficulties, I got broke off. Now we're going to throw out some more chum. Try to get these boys chummed up. So we're going to take one. Reach just got broke off again. I'm getting hit left and right. So I have my bail open. Okay. Alright, now we're gonna drop it back in there. So here's a chunk. Break the tail off of it. Like so, throw that in. Take like this. Throw it out there. Alright, now we're dropping it in the water. Feeling the line as I let it out. So I'm letting it out, letting it out. It's sinking down to the bottom. Sink it down. Alright, I'm near the bottom. Drag this set pretty tight. Got one! Loser, loser! Look at that mango, y'all. First mango back in the bay in a while. It's a good certified keeper. Reese got one. Here, pop down here. Hey, the jigs are drinkable right now, but we're chumming in some greenbacks. Gotta adjust the boat. There's a big show under the boat. Oh, There's a big chum, big stuff showing on the fish finder. Right now, everything must go. So I'm going a heavy chum right now. I'm trying to get these things layered. Just had one. Uh oh, Reese had one. We 
haven't fished for two weeks and we lost our touch. Oh. Oh, that's Kubera. I mean, they're fat goosers, I'll tell you that. Look at that guy. He just spit up a bunch of our chum. I'm one of the only bay mango fishermen that will let him go. Alright, so now, got him chummed up. Throw some more chum in. And this just gets him fired up. Letting it sink down. Kind of being weird, they're hitting it like on the bottom, but another bad. Kind of two nice ones. That's another solid keeper right there. Oh, Reese got one here. Hop down right here, Reese. So we got a ton of greenbacks in the bucket right now. So we're gonna throw these in as chum. Got a greenback right here. Gonna put them on the yellowtail jig. All right, dropping it in, the chum slip. The key to these mangoes is if you chum, they will come. So dropping it in. I got a 4K twin power right here. 20 pound braid, 20 pound leader. We put it like 15 feet on there just to give it some extra if we break off or so they can't see it. So letting it go down. Oh, Reese just got fortune. I just got hit. So every few minutes, I just take a big clump of chum. Throw it out there. So they have something to keep keeping them there. Flow for a second. I had to reposition the boat because the current shifted. Got another mango here on the yellowtail jig. Ooh. Get them up, boy. Reese got a goozer one. This is either boozer class or, or gag. Oh yeah. That's a goozer right there, people. If you're talking about a goozer mango in the bay, look at that thing. That is a fatty. That's a 20 incher. We're gonna need a picture with him. Get a pick. There's Reese's big mango. Here, you want to step up? All right, so that is the boozer, and that's a normal big one. So, we're gonna get them both released. All right, there you go. That one goes, and there goes that one. There he goes. All right, Reese just caught that big one. I can catch one just like it. Hopefully y'all enjoyed today's video and sorry for not uploading for the past month or so as I have not really been fishing that much. I went to the Keys in August 14th to the 20th. We got some good fishing in but didn't get enough for a YouTube video. But hopefully soon I'll get my boat fixed as right now there's a small leak in the lower unit so there's water in my lower unit fluid. 
So I did run it with that just to get a YouTube video out because it's been like a month, but hopefully soon I'll get that fixed, can get back on our weekly upload schedule. But make sure to stay tuned, hit that subscribe button down below, and I'll see you next time.